It's all slipping away from me. Zach, can you hear me? Elaine, is that you? Please, Zach. I know you think what you're doing is right. All right, Quill, is this your idea? That dubious honor belongs to Sergeant Calloway. Well, it won't work. Now, you get her out of here now. Zach, someone wants to talk to you. Hi, Casey. Listen, sweetheart. You take mommy, and you go on home, you wait for me, okay? Why are you doing this? Oh, baby, sometimes things are just too hard to explain to you, okay? You always say the truth, Daddy. Yeah, that's right. And Daddy loves you. Now, you be a big girl, and you take mommy home, and you wait for me. Can the other kids come, too? They're not bad. All right, all right. If that's what you want, sweetheart, all right. Okay, guys, come on. Come on, I want you to run to these other cops over here. Run to, run. Stay together. What about Gina? I don't think he's going to open fire in front of his daughter. Let's get her out of here. No! I said just the kids! Are you either clear my family out, or this girl's gonna die? Daddy, please! You just do as I said now! George, you hurt that girl and you'll be written off as a lunatic. Nobody will listen to a word you have to say. Hey, Sergeant! I'm already gone, don't you understand? Now, I'm gonna give you a five count to clear my family out of here. That goes one, two, three... God help you, Zag! Mrs. Torrance, wait! All right, here is the deal. I want a chopper and a news crew. And I want you to clear all these cops off of the beach. And I'm gonna give you five minutes to do that. We need more time than that. This is not a negotiation. I said five minutes and five minutes I mean. At the end of that time, I'm gonna start picking off soft targets at random. What's it gonna be, Quill? There's one thing we can try. Zach. If you start killing people, these cops will chop you up like dog food. Your story dies with you, and this whole thing is meaningless. Do you really want your daughter to remember you as a killer without a cause? Well, my dad was shot down when I was Casey's age. I don't even remember what he looked like. At least I'll have one thing he didn't have. I'm not going to die alone. All right, Torrance, you got it. The chopper and news crew are on their way in. I've instructed the troops to pull out of my signal. Yes. There's a condition. What condition? A trade-off. We'll send in an officer, unarmed. You give up the girl and let the rest of the people on the beach clear out. Not a chance. Like you said before, this is not a negotiation. The clock is ticking, Zach. We're prepared to launch a full-out assault, and we're not going to say one, two, three, go. Please, Zach. I'm not ready to die. Are you? All right. Send in your man.
Let her go. Uh-uh, hero. Now you're not calling the shots in here. I am. Yeah. On your knees. Hands behind your head. Whatever you say. Now, sweetheart, it's been real nice knowing you. Now, you live yourself a full life, okay? Stop! Take it easy, Ellie. I knew there was something I liked about you. Maybe. Maybe not. Couldn't take the chance. This soapy stuff. It's party time. Come on, let's show them how we do it. Pretty romantic story. I'll say. To think that any good came out of that nightmare. Amazing. Did you ever get any idea of what Operation Wipeout was about? Officially nothing. Unofficially, nothing. And Quill? His cover's so deep, he doesn't even exist. Do you want to dance? It's my pleasure. Nighttime turned to rainy day. But blue sky.